Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our death campaign. We have all of our people out running caravans right now. We are not making much because it is still very early in the game and the economy has not stabilized. Something I haven't done before, which I've now been doing, is the escort merchant caravan, which I feel is actually better than doing bandit bases right now. Uh, it helps out a ton as you're taking a lot of injuries along the way. So what this is doing is it is massively helping out my medicine. I mean, I'm day 120 or something like that, and I'm almost 75 medicine for doctors off because I've got all these people healing. It's really a pretty good system that I haven't done before. So I guess I'm just going to keep doing it. And it's like, why stop now? Let's see what we got for foodie food. So, uh, 60, a little bit of fish. Oh, we need to watch our speed. I forgot about that. All right, we have a 0.5 hurting penalty and we do have prisoners. How many prisoners do we have? We got 33 prisoners. All right, do we have enough troops? No, we need more troops. So let's go look for a laborer's quest real quick. See if we can get one out of this. While our guys come back, there's our laborer's quest. Show me the money. The cool thing about these guys is I believe they count as bandits. So I think I still get roguery for it with the useful companions mod. All right, let's go look for another one now. Oh, uh, I probably should have checked for troops. Oh my word, look at that. They got tour goods. I, I, almost, I almost have to take them. They got war horses already. That's the one big thing about switching over to cons guard is you got to have a war horse for every one of these light colored guys to turn them into the dark colored one. So this right here cost me 350. That's going to be about half the price of a horse. So it's almost smart for me to invest into them whenever possible. I'm like, uh, I don't really, I should have grabbed some more troops, but I'd be a fool not to take them. I'm probably going to end up losing them. I think this one also is a castle. Yeah, this one's a castle. Nope, they don't have any. There, Now we got full guys. So let's go find... Not a bandit base. <sighs> Bounty hunters. Um, oh boy. Nope, I'm not going to do it. I'm sticking to the plan. That's, that's going to pay 3,000. I bet you there would be a bandit base around here. That would be 6,000. But like I said, I want to stick to the plan. I think I have a good plan going. Can't do a needs weapons quest because I'm such a high plan tier now. I'd probably need like nine weapons, so I'm not going to do that. Oh, I could send another companion out. That's right. We didn't have good companions. I forgot about that. In the last episode, we looked up companions and there weren't good companions. And there's nobody tremendous out there. That's that, not that wanderer won't work. Uh, we, yeah, because we had a double wanderer. Yeah, there's the Asteri wanderer, which is a high level. And then for some reason... Do, do, do. No steward. No tactics. No medicine. I mean, technically, she... Wait a minute. 
Is she merciful? No, she's not. Um, now that I think about it, maybe I will take her. Yeah. I don't plan on having any vassals, just companion clans. So, yeah, let's take her. Level 12, we don't know if we're going to get one lower. Let's just grab the best options we can. Because I think there was a couple guys that I had problems with. Ones that weren't going to be able to become companion clans. I believe I had a couple that were like that. So uh, we're going to have to watch out for that. But I still think the escort merchant caravan, that's the way to go. Uh, I'm. It's another one of those situations where I didn't really enjoy doing the quest until people actually asked me about it and then once they ask me about it and i try it then i'm like yeah i kind of enjoy this and i think that's what's been happening a, a lot late well i shouldn't say lately but over the past year or two people have made suggestions which i love the suggestions and every once in a while somebody will make one and i'll fall in love with it like glaives being a mercenary these are all things I never used to do. And now that people have actually suggested it, uh, I kind of like doing it. Special weapons order. I kind of want to get them away from t this territory, though. I hate sending companions out in this territory. Look at them all. They're just all down here now. In fact, we're just going to send her out from Onira. there okay now i probably can only take like one more now nah, two more all right let's go find us an escort merchant caravan we're good we're 5.1 speed you want to be probably at least five speed to do this so you can keep up with them overpriced but you got to find now you got to find a quest that's what really sucks I do like it, but finding one is not easy. Army of Poachers, which, you know, that's not terrible. Nah, we're not going to do it. Once again, I want to try and stick with the plan. We got a plan. Let's stick with it. While these guys are out and they're dang. Woo! Look at that money. Here we go. Who are you? All right. Who's first? Like Aaron. As the Raiders. I want him at least tier two. So now I got him tier two. And I don't want them We're not looking for a to be involved in the battle so they lose troop. And I got to rush up here to get reinforcements. But you got to be careful because they can get attacked by bandits. Didn't get attacked. Get up here. Recruit troops. There we go. All right. Wait for them to show up. Boom. All right. Down to Volstrom. Which way are you going to go? But that way, by me doing this now I, with grabbing the targets, I'm actually leveling them if they survive. 
Come on, where are you guys at? Which way are you going? Yep, yeah, this way. Right? We've got no quarrel with you. Lost eleven that time. Increased all the tier ones. Down here to get the troops. I forget how many stops we gotta make. How many stops? Four stops. All right, back off. And to Denostica. So much easier to do this at Clan Tier 2. When you have the troops to actually outnumber them. Makes it a million times easier. In fact, it would be cool if they had a laborer's quest. Mess with us and we'll... I got a laborer's quest right now. Because it's probably more than what they can actually handle. Do you have a laborer's quest? They sometimes can get attacked twice. Oh, beautiful. Look at this. Because we're actually out of room right now. We wouldn't be able to hold more. That's 15,000, 16,000. This will be stop number three. One more stop. Where are we going? Hopefully someplace short. That's not bad. I would assume he's going to go up through Onira. Nope, he's going to cut up this way. Alright, where are you guys at? Last one. We've got no quarrel with you. And they didn't get involved. Boom. Ooh, lost 11. It's just the, the wounded is the big thing. A balanced hunting bow. 63. Look at the skills. Gourmet. Double. Relation for food variety. Um, this one isn't a huge deal. I did take Cracker just for the increased speed following. And then loose formation from what Strat says is the best. Alright, let's get up here and we've completed this one. And I still have one more well, set of guys I can get rid of. Boom, done. Now we can go look for our next one. We're at 36,000. And look at that. 1,500 we're going to make. Although we do have wounded. I forgot we got aid core. Steward perk. You don't pay for wounded troops. So as you know, my wounded troops come back now, I mean, I'm at, at 320, 328 for wages, 336. Love way up uh, Acor. Man, that really comes in handy. Alright, gang leader needs recruits. Take those two. Uh, how's my speed? Alright, I got a point two hurting penalty. Which we no, we don't have any animals. Wow. We don't have any animals at all. I do. I want, I want uh, 76. Okay, oh, kind of wait. This is where we got it. All right, 108 Stumpters. 
Most likely it's the Sumpters that are doing it to us. Although I do need to get rid of regular horses. But not right now. I gotta find a place that doesn't have horses. And I don't know if I was actually checking the towns when I stopped by them. I should be checking those out. Alright, a bunch of people probably got points somewhere. Uh, you're going to take uh, Drill Sergeant because you're going to be a party leader. Governor, I'd take seven veterans. The Thief, Pathfinder, the Healer. You can be a party leader. Uh, less food consumption. Oh, oh, wait. It's uh, it's honor. I got to keep remembering it's honor. There's like two different things you got to remember. You got to remember that you can't have positive mercy. Or if they're in your army, when you show mercy after taking a fief, you're going to lose relation. And you can't have negative or you can't have positive mercy or positive honor. I hope I said that right. Mercy is in your army showing mercy. Positive honor is executing. As long as you don't have positive honor, that you can execute anyone you want and they don't care. So I do need to watch out for that. Brigands. No. Right, let's go ahead down to Poros again. Let's just kind of watch where we're at now. Look at that. 2,300. You can make... I. People don't really get how good caravans are. Yeah, they're not good at war. It's still the one thing that I, I caution people with that they just don't really get is they're going to attract attention if you're at war. You don't, you, they're just not meant to run at war. You don't want to do it. They're going to get captured very quickly. I would just rather have them in my army than anything. Now, this one's actually not bad. Those guys are not terrible. So that's 3,000. That could actually, one of those could be a bandit base. That would actually be 6,000. Um. I'm just worried that they're just all going to be a help with brigands. Which I can't do because there's only two of them in there. You need like five or six at this time right now. Yeah, help with brigands. That's what I figured. Figured it was all going to be help with brigands. Uh, I should be able... Uh, I got nine footmen. Let me just send these guys... Wait a minute, what's my weapon? I got my weapon on? Yeah, let me double check my weapon. Yeah, I got my weapon on. And uh, 27 mountain bandits. Look at that. All right, I'm going to RTS it. I mean, that's obvious. Uh oh. Oh, yeah, I got them. I got all nine. Whew. I was like, wait a minute, I don't have them? Yeah, we'll just RTS it. Former shield wall! Charge! Go get them, boys. Mountain bandits aren't too bad. Force bandits, eh. Their arrows are once again kind of like doing a Kuzite bandit base. The arrows can be a little bit iffy. As long as they stay in their formation, Sea Raiders and Mountain Bandits aren't too bad. They do use javelins, but if they got their shields up, they should be okay. Asurai are definitely the easiest and the best to fight, but they don't have a lot of bandit base. That's the problem with using... Just Asurai alone. If they had more like the Kuzite, I would stay there. Ooh, I lost one. 
and I probably will duel the guy. I do have my hammer. He's got a one-hander. Uh, I can't. I, I can't remember if it's him or I think it's Sea Raiders. Also have a two-hand. Oh, I lost another one. Out. Okay, that hurts. I lost two footmen. I, I should have replacements though. Well, it's only three of them. I probably should send my guys in. Yeah, it's only three of them. Curl them all! There we go. I only lost those two. Woo, look at that. I'm going to take the caravan guard. I think I'll take all the cab. That's just going to make me go faster. Oops. One too many. Legendary infantry act. Decent stuff. There we go. Uh, now that I look at this... I could get others. Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. I'm not gonna do it. I'm, I'm not gonna fight with him. Because he's gonna send his cab, and my guys aren't gonna get there. So, not even worry about it. Alright. Five. Next. With, with doing this, boy, do I want to put another point in? Now, let's get scouting done. Scouting even a death campaign is important because of the minor clans. To get rid of minor clans, you have to execute all four of them at the same time. Or, I think you could execute one and it would go down three. But the point is, you need to execute all of them at the same time. So, you got to be able to hold them. And you need to reduce the escape champ. So that is why I'm doing that, and another escort merchant caravan. Problem is now, what I should do is, is I should get rid of these bandits, even... Ooh, I got 1,300. I should get rid of the mountain bandits, because they're not worth as much. I'm going to go over, is the problem. So I'm going to get rid of them. It's going to speed me up because I'm only at a five speed. A one four hurting penalty. There, zero three hurting. All right, where are we going? Almost up to 60,000. All right, I'm going to us. Where you at? There you are. Yeah. Well, I lost three that time. That was good. Who knows if it's my army makeup, though, that's doing it. I got some cav. So, that could be why I did so good on that fight. Sometimes I lose 11. Sometimes I don't lose any. All right, let's wait. Nobody's here. I hate how it, you're traveling with them, but you're actually not. It, it'll show you going with them, but you're still in town. All right, down to Zayanica. Well, come out wherever you are. And hey, I'm actually out of room now. I need troop. I'm still going to be out of room. 
We got one more to go. Right, where are we going? Rotate. To check to see if some need to go to tier two. Yep, all those need to go to tier two. You don't want to get too far ahead because they can spawn behind you. Those so pop right out of nowhere at times. Mess with us. All right, how many can I keep? That's it. All right. So. Uh, what's the higher tier? Yeah, that's the higher tier. 12 short. I think that was our, this is our fourth one. 67 medicine. Yeah, by hit 75. Oh no, we got one more to go. Yikes. Okay, little sis is, is it apprentice? Yeah, apprentice, construct, tactic, three injuries, charm. I'm gonna stick with that because she's got to get 25 medicine. All right, where are we going? Last stop. Unfortunately, we don't have the troops, though. We're not going to be able to carry all these people. Because we only have room for, you can see, eight. But we are going to take losses in the battle. And that's going to drop our prisoner capacity. All right, you're going to Artesia, so I'm assuming you're going to go south. There you are. There you are. Yeah. What you want? All right. Once again, yep. See, we can't really take that many. Sixty-one. Can't even, I think, get that many in a laborer's class. I think right around 55 or so is the max you're going to get in a laborer's quest. So it's, I think it's random each time. Now, how much did this pay? 5,500. So what are we halfway through this episode? Halfway through this episode, and what did I have? 20,000 plus those troops? I've now got 79,000, plus I have full prisoners I need to get rid of. Bad, this is a bad part of the map though. Really bad part of the map. There's nothing here. I would have to go here, up to here to find one. Um, Asteroid territory only has three in there, one. Two, yeah, three in their entire territory. So, I think we should look and see how we're doing on food. I want to do like at least one more so I can actually get Dr. Zoll. I always take appraiser. That's the selling of equipment instead of trade goods yeah it's gonna help out with caravan but you gotta remember this is selling only not buying so we want to do it when selling equipment from battle all right where do i want to go uh let's go south how are we doing on grape 
Yeah, we only got 38 grapes left. Let's go grab grapes. It's the only thing we really have to grab here. We can get everything else uh, where we're going to be going next. And they even have dates right there. So let's grab these. What, maybe one more? Eh, maybe two. It all depends on how much we get from the caravans. And I went to the wrong one, but I'm not worried about it. That was just dates. I meant to go to the other one for dates. I don't care. We're going to get dates here in just a moment down in Asurai territory. Yeah, the problem is we got to get rid of these guys. There's, there's only the three spots. I don't even know why I'm stopping there. I have almost no reason to stop. Yeah, only 40 olives. There's 55. Look at the grain. That's still a problem where there's way too much grain. Okay. We got the olives. Let's see if they got a laborer's quest. I have enough. I was going to stop there, but I have enough. And that has been burned, so I can't do that. We'll go over here. They're going to have fish. And they do have dates as well. No. I got 17,000 worth of guys on me right now. For the quest. I don't really want to get rid of any of my horses for traveling. I got 50 fish. Uh, I'm, oh, yeah, dates. There. I have everything but butter and cheese. And butter and cheese, we're going to get up north. There we go. I bought them for about 50, 55, 339. Wow. I gained 12 points. I'm up to 72 in trade. All right. Two base, so we lose no morale when we recruit bandit prisoners. I have dates. I got everything I need here. Let us just immediately go. I probably should stop by and check them out, though. We are we are only going 4.1, though. 0.36 herd. Let me stop off here. 37 for Sumters. I need to get rid of them. I still am negative point two. I will right, we'll go check the second one. And then hopefully we can get a final. I'm hoping my next one should be the final one to do. No draft. Damn. And I'm too high a level for draft animals right now. He's going to require like 15 sumpters or 20 sumpters. And all they give you is meat. So I don't need that. And once again, absolutely nothing. So I can't even take a quest because I'm full of prisoners. I made 1700 that day. That's really good. Yeah, we're already up over 100k. But now I need to find a laborer's quest. Now I got 17,000 worth of guys. It's like, yeah. Come on. Draft. Now, let's go over here. There's, there's definitely spots here where we could get it. 40 looters. 
Look at that. The army never even went after them. 40 looters and they don't even touch them. Clears your lands. It would train your troop and they don't even touch it. Draft again. And I got rid of all my tools, so I can't do that. Sadly, I should have held on to tools. I don't know. Yep, you do have one. They could have a laborer's quest. Art of the trade. I don't know. Did I go? Wait a minute. Did I respect it? No, I still have it. I gotta make sure I respect Charm for Warlord when I become a Merc. I actually think I could be losing renown by this. Uh, 54 is the max. So we gotta pull seven back. Boom. One hundred twenty-one thousand. Wow, that's good. It doesn't happen often, but it happens. People give me suggestions, and I don't do a lot of them. But once in a while, uh, I'll take a caravan ambush too. People will suggest, and I'll be like, you know. Yeah, that's a darn good idea. And here's a, here's a classic situation. Twenty six of them, righty. I mean that is a that is a quest. Twenty six would fit in the laborers. There's the laborers. Got lucky on this. He wants twenty three. We can get rid of them right now. That way we got full capacity for another escort merchant caravan. One hundred thirty. 135 135,000 and I still got all that equipment although the equipment's going to be used with the steward perks to increase the noble son to cons guard Sixty-eight medicine had I put another point into it. I would have had it already. I think I would have had 75 but Scouting more important caravan master increased carrying capacity Reduce food consumption And day traveler because most of the time traveled is during the day Okay, uh, she needs medicine Well, we want help with brigands. Uh, are we just going to do one more? Trying to think how many more we're going to do. He's got an ambush. But if I take an ambush, then... I won't have enough guys for a merchant caravan. Should I respect it right now? I'm wondering if I'm losing renown. I feel like I'm losing renown from the three fights. You're only getting one for the quest. Maybe I should respect now. Because this one battle is probably going to get me four or five. Yeah, I really think I should. 
Although the arena is not open. Yeah, let's let's respect. The longer you go, the more it's going to end up costing you, anyways. Me, social, charm. Yep, 6,600. When you get up into the 275 to 300 range, it costs like, you know, it's like 10, 12,000. There, now we can get over to Warlord. Um, I really doing tournaments, so I don't really care about it, but Warlord... I like doing forgivable grievances. A crit fail means you're automatically done. Yeah, you want to try to get a double crit success, but a crit fail is the worst thing that can happen to you. Young and respectful. Firebrand. And I take effort for the people. This is kind of a waste of perk. I don't hire Merc Group. Some people do. I just don't. There. Now, let's see how much we're going to get for this. Probably going down to Dynostica. Yeah, Dynostica. That's what I figured. Well, I thought... Let's get away. We get away. And we don't even have... You don't even have to... You don't have to wait for them. You can't stay in range of them or you get a warning. If you're too close, and if you do it a second time, the mission fails. But if you get ahead, you can just go attack them. And this will automatically complete the quest now. How much did I get? Yeah, look at that. Eight renown. Yeah, I'm glad I switched over. And that's it. The quest is done. Yeah, see? You don't even need to wait. How many did I get? I got 20. I got enough to do another quest. If there's a quest close by. Because I'm not going to be able to do an escort merchant caravan. I don't have enough room. So if I actually find one, I'll do it. Laborers. Wow, that's making good money. I would think we're maybe 150 days in. Which is my normal time in a world conquest that I want to become a merc. I got 140k. What day are we on? I'm curious. Oh, we're 187. We're already past it. In a world conquest, I want to be going by that 150. All right, rival gang. Okay, what do I want to do? I am at the point right now. Oh, 75. Uh, we want the plus party size limit. And now we get forced labor, so prisoners carry stuff. Somebody had to have leveled. Um, you're going to need a weapon skill. Wow. She's, um, I guess we're going to go one-handed. She is a party leader, so I want to keep her safe. So I'm going to want her to have a shield. Where are we going to go now? We're, we're almost like... I, I could go collect up Noble Sun right now. And I do want to attack him. This is what I wanted to do. Was this. This is really good to do early in the game. Take and move everybody back. Take only your infantry and move them up. 
send in your infantry. They're going to take losses, which is going to get you medicine. And because I'm going to be fighting with Khan's guard, uh, that not many are going to go down in battle. You're not going to gain much medicine. So you want to actually get that medicine done now. And hopefully get 75 before you actually become a mercenary. What am I at? 70. Five more to go. I don't see that. That could be a bandit base, but I honestly don't care. Uh, Tail World killed bandit bases for me now. Do you actually have one? They're famous for having caravan ambushes here. No, they need draft animals. Especially between Akalot and Odak. Famous for it. So I actually want to look and see. Bounty hunters. That's, ah. I don't like Kuzite, though. Me and Akalot. Bounty Hunters. Double Bounty Hunters quest. There's bound to be a bandit base quest, so that's six grand right there. But it is Kuzite, and I just, I don't want to deal with the Kuzite right now. Uh, let's see. Snare the wealthy. I thought that was you had to attack the caravan. Is what I thought it was. But I haven't done that quest too much. And you got nobody here. Oh, I do actually need butter, meat, and cheese. I did forget about that. Now I'm going to go with that medicine. But I also need to get a glaive. That's going to be 30, 40,000. Mm, let's see. 114 sumpters. Yep, extremely low. All right, there we go. Back up to 75 of each of those. Uh, almost out of beer. We're going to have to find beer. Might as well take the uh, tools. Now, once again, I'm going to have to figure out how long am I going to be a mercenary for with my cons guard. I know it can get very boring. Caravan ambush. Extremely boring. But, man, it just, you go so quick doing it. Going to my cab. All right, so let's go up and let's get out of this way. Raiders, gotcha. That's enough for a uh, labor quest. That's done. Okay, no labor quest there. Let's go check here for. Oh, let's check here for labors. Then we can just go ahead right down to Anira. Wow, the money I'm making. That's crazy. Our uh, the trade. It still gives me one renown. I mean, I, I honestly have enough to, to grab Khan's guard. Are the trade again. Another reason, I, I love Art of the Trade. It just, it gives you a free renown. You pay for the goods. You go take the salt up here now. 
And you're going to actually make money on it. It's, it's one of the best you can do. All right, we don't need draft animals. We're not going to go that way. Um... I'm trying to figure out if I should start it now. Look at all of them. I have clan tier. Clan tier three. Hmm. Do I want to do another one? Trying to think if I want to do one more. I don't have to. I'm making a thousand a day. I only need about 150k to do this. I like, but I do need to buy my weapon though. Uh, that's something I gotta look at right now. Now, uh, yeah. I think I prefer the Rumphalia from Batania, but I don't know if they're gonna have it. Did you have a labor's quest for me, please? You do. Peace to you. I kept the looters just because they're not worth much, and they do give me roguery from the useful companions mod. I'm starting to think I should stop right now. I'm in Kuzai territory. While these guys are still running around making me money. Good money now. Now that we're up near day near two. Uh, near day 200. This is when you're going to start making two to three thousand a day on caravans. And I have room to get another companion. Not long before my little sister becomes of age, too. She's probably got another 100 days and she's ready to go. 100, 150 days or so. I'm thinking I should. I think I should go pick up Khan's guard. That I'm, I'm not going to do that. Pick up the noble son on recording. It just involves me going up down here and getting all the noble son I can and then grabbing up. About 75 to 100 step horses, well, step hunters. So that way I can convert them over to cons guard. I think I should do it now. We're clan tier three, which means I got access to castle dungeon. So I can, even though I'm gaining roguery, I could do a couple prison breaks because I always want to get 100. It's always my goal. Getting manhunter for the prisoner limit. And getting in best light if my villages get raided. So I'm thinking I want to do it now. Which is a good idea. Because we're right at the end of this episode too. So I can go collect all these up. Get the war horses. And then re uh, I just need to go find my weapon. Which I'm going to take a trip to Batania. If, see if they got the Rumpali. If not, I'll grab the long glaive. I really... I think I prefer the Rumphalia. It, it just, to me, I, I think it has more length on it, which is what I really like out of my weapon. So I believe that's what I'm going to go ahead and do. Which means in our next episode, we'll be Consguard. Well, we'll be Mercenary. We'll be working up the Consguard. Yeah, I think that's the way to go. Although I did, I kind of want to do a couple quick battles to get 75 doctors over. I have all these troops. This is actually now when you do it, you look for looters or whatever it is. 
and where you know you're going to take a bunch of losses. And that way you're going to... No, they don't have one there. You're going to get medicine. And that's what I kind of want to do right now. Look at all these troops here. All these low tier troops that are going to get hurt. Uh, so that's what uh, I might end up looking for if I come across some looters or something like that. I'm going to end up trying to get 75 medicine before the next episode. So I'm going to go grab all of my noble son that I need. Grab my horses, food, and weapon. And then in the next episode, uh, we're going to be mercenary. I'll have to probably get rid of all my guys, too. Uh, it's going to take me a little bit to get them. It takes about a week to get them out of being caravans and into your party. So I'll look at doing that as well. So, yeah, in the next episode, we'll be mercenary, and we can start kicking some butt. So I will see you guys then. Take care. And thanks for watching.